see how long I can go unblinking through the Vsauce eyes. <laughs> Vsauce convinced me. I ordered this curiosity box. Oh, I can't do it. My eyes already hurt. <laughs> Uh, ordered this curiosity box because of Vsauce he made a video or something on it and this one is a Lego engine middle gear box I kind of forget what it is but it really interested me at the time and I've been waiting at least six months I totally forgot about this thing so let's open it up I don't know how Vsauce does it in his videos but he doesn't blink in any of his shorts and you can watch him unedited he'll do some where it's just you know face to face no cuts or anything he doesn't blink in any of them and i tried to open the video with that and of course immediately my eyes started burning because i was doing like this trying to get that v-sauce look so ooh, solenoid engine curious gears ah that's right i wanted all the weird gears as well so it says Lego on there, and I don't know if this was produced by Lego, Lego compatible solenoid kit. So let's check this out. I am pretty excited about this. Maybe I'll put it together with my kids or whatever. Uh, the gear set was a different part. You had to get this and this is like a upgrade pack or whatever. This is not available alone. This is available alone. So the gears are just a bunch of weird shapes, like Nautilus-shaped gears. You can kind of see one right there. And the way that they work is you would put the high side of the Nautilus into the low side of this Nautilus, and as they spin around, they continuously mesh. It also makes it variable speed as well. And then we have this guy. I think that's also variable speed to where it rotates along the outside, and then it catches a tooth on the inside, goes quickly, and then slow on the outside. So just kind of... Mm, something neat to play with really but this this part as you can see I went back to my normal knife the other ones eh, they were neat and all but I prefer this one I suppose we'll have to do another video on that later so this guy this guy is a solenoid engine oh look at there perfect it has all the information. We got a magnetic piston. We got the connecting rod, electromagnets, cams, flywheels, cranks, crankshafts, and the electrical contacts. So it actually has physical contacts, the commutated, or what would it be called? Uh, it's like the distributor, essentially. It, it has a distributor on there that makes it go. And this is essentially what you would consider a Lego kit. Oh, it's got pink tweezers interesting well i'm not gonna open this up because I'd, I'd rather do this with my kids or by myself when i know that i'm going to actually finish it so it has no batteries included evidently you can measure it shows you right here measure using these <laughs> pardon me using these instructions so hmm this will be fun Let's just kind of go through it. Yeah, it's, it's just like a, a Technics style kit. And it looked really neat. So there we go. Well, I'm not going to spend too much time getting into this because I really just need to build it and bring it back, I suppose. But I'm kind of excited about this. And wonder if any of y'all had picked up this. Yeah, maybe really niche specific. Maybe you didn't get the advertisement like I did. So yeah, look out for it. Maybe it's available now. I had to pre-order it. Like I said, it, it took a long time to come in. But well, I'll bring it home. My son's really into Lego. So is my daughter, but she doesn't have that much attention span yet, I suppose, for something like this. But we'll see if I can get the kids involved. And if not, I'll just do it myself because I also like Legos. So there you go. The solenoid engine from Curiosity Box. We'll see how this comes together in the future. Thanks for tuning in. Have a great day. You've made it to the end of the video. Hopefully that means you liked what you saw. If you want to help out the channel, you can like, subscribe, and definitely comment down below. We would like to hear new ideas from you, so be sure you let us know what you'd like to see. There are some other suggestions probably floating by my head right now that you can check out. And otherwise, we appreciate your support and your help growing the channel.